Game one went to the challenger. Janice is dealing out the same two decks of cards with the next cards off the top of the decks. And Patrice, who has some catching up to do. Now, you haven't been behind very often, Patrice. Just one other time. One other time. Now she's got to try to make a comeback. Patrice, we asked 100 marriage counselors. Generally speaking, does a man who has been divorced three times have a reasonable chance of making his fourth marriage a success? How many marriage counselors said, yes, he does have a reasonable chance for a successful fourth marriage? Well, my father used to do some counseling in marriage, and he has explained to me that usually second, third, fourth are a little bit harder as far as keeping it intact. So I think the number is how many... How many said, yes, they have a chance for a successful fourth marriage? I'll say 38 to have a chance. 38 out of 100. Marriage counselor said, after three, you still have a reasonable chance for success in the fourth. Well, the third time is usually the charm. And once you start going past the third time, I imagine it's still going to go downhill. And I imagine the marriage counselors would agree with that. I'm going to say that number is a little bit lower. Lower than that. Mm -hmm. The actual number of marriage counselors who said a man divorced three times is a chance for making his fourth marriage a success is 31. It is a little lower. Patty. And the challenger starts game two. With a 10. I think we'll change that card. Try something else. Winning the question, she changes it to an 8. Oh, <laughs> up the middle, we'll guess it and say higher. Higher than an 8. No, oh. a 7 is not higher. And now Patrice has a free chance to play a king. Good card. Lower. Lower than a king. A 5. Higher. Risking it higher, it is a jack. Lower. Lower than the jack, an 8. You were, you were going off that jack with a lot of confidence since a lot of face cards have already gone through your deck, Patrice. And now, Patty, the question to you. Patty, we asked 100 women in their 40s. As, sounds like a soap opera. As the sands of time slip through the hourglass for you, which is slipping faster, your top or your bottom? How many women in their 40s said their bottom is slipping faster? Well, I'm a long way off from being 40, but my mother and many of her friends are. And I think a lot of people are, don't tell my mother this, <laughs> um, probably worry Your about... Your mother, the child bride, really? Yes, yeah, she was only 13 when she got... No. <laughs> How many said the bottom is slipping faster? <laughs> yes, the bottom slipping faster, I think, would say about 39. Patty says 39 out of 100 said the bottom is slipping faster than the top. Women in their 40s. I think that number is going to be higher. I think the bottom has a tendency. Yes, ha has a it's the bottom that goes that. first. <laughs> <laughs> the actual number of women in their 40s whose bottom is slipping faster is 61. It is much higher. Patrice. Patrice with an 8. Okay, let's change that card. Getting rid of the middle card. A 3. Now you haven't been able to turn that card over yet. That's all right. I remember it's a three. Thank you, Janice. And she says it's higher for the win. No! Again, she could not turn the last card over. Patty, play off the eight again. Well, since it's my lucky chance here, uh, I think I'll stick with my intuition and say higher. Higher than an eight? No. Once again, a seven was turned over. Thank you, Jan. And Janice will finish her housekeeping there as the question goes to you, Patrice. And you've had troubles with that last card. Patrice, we asked the mayors of 100 cities across the country. Since you've become mayor, have you gotten a traffic ticket in your own town? How many mayors said they have gotten a ticket? Well, I don't know if this is um, good, right or not, but I don't think that if a policeman stopped a mayor that he'd get a ticket. I mean, personal opinion, I don't think they would. So I think it's going to be a low number. I'm going to say 20. Patrice says 20 out of 100 have gotten a ticket. Patty? I've gotten stopped by a policeman a number of times, and about half the time I've been lucky enough to cry my way out of it or something. And I would imagine that a mayor would have a little more pull, and I think that number's going to be lower. Mayor Bradley would look funny crying, I would yes. think. You said it lower. The actual number of mayors who've gotten the traffic ticket in their own town is 23, not lower. Patrice. And again, Patrice, we're looking at that one card to tie things up. It's got to be higher. Higher than a three. This time it is. And Patrice ties up the best. Wow. That is about the fifth time you got to that last card. It turned over this time, and so we set up for the tiebreaker. Each player with one game at $100. Three cards up there, three questions here. Patty, our man on the street, went to Italy, where he asked 100 men in Milan, do you approve of young couples living together before they get married? How many Italian men said, yes, they do approve of couples living together? Huh, Italians are quite romantic, but they're also very Catholic. 
and they, you know, stick by their religion pretty much. I'm going to say about 45. And he says 45 out of 100 do approve of couples living together. Well, I think the Catholic is stronger than the romantic, so I'm going to say it's lower. Lower. The actual number of Italian men who approve of couples living together is 92. Wow. Romantic is definitely stronger. So Patty gets control in the tiebreaker. Starting with a 7. Change that card. Getting rid of the 7. Cha 10. Uh, lower. Lower than the 10. It is a 4. Higher. It is higher. We have a new champion for the win. We do win. Patrice Burris, yeah. time to say goodbye. Congratulate your parents on that 40th anniversary. I That's sure lovely. Will. And you are leaving us with $15,100 in cash. I've had a wonderful time. You've been a great champion. Oh, thank you, thank Patrice. you. Bye bye. Patrice Burris. Patty, come on down here. Yes, yes, definitely. Yeah. This is the place to be. Yes, I was lucky, I think. Oh, you're a good player. You defeated a tough champion. So I hope, I hope that Patty does just as well as Patrice. Maybe better. She can do it. Right after this commercial break, comes the money cards.